it would help if I didn't have um, Twitch open and vocals, so I end up hearing it myself. All right, let's get back to it. Hello, whoever might be out there. Be prepared for some very scuffed stuff. <laughs> uh, and the cats come in. Right, let's see. Oh, and of course, lighting is all kind of weird. So the green screen's not working all the... Ah, there we go. Of course, I'm going to end up very see-through, but that'll just add to the charm, I guess. Um, right, so... Uh, where were we last time? Oh, Christ. Uh, I just need to check something... All right, so there we go. So, yeah, what's that? And so last time, I basically was getting back to the point I was at the last time I played Wonder Song. And I think it's done what it did. What was yeah, it's doing what it was doing last time, which is bizarrely deciding it's going to <sighs> and right. I'm not quite sure. Indeed it is! And hello, Mellow Jacket, or shall I call you by your real name? I'm never quite sure with this sort of situation. Uh... I was not expecting that reaction. <laughs> Singer from the Crazy Raven. Fair enough. <laughs> Just instantly switch from fanboying to brood. What's this Muppet looking fellow got to say? Yes, I saw your show. Everyone in the town may have loved it, but I, well, I thought it was pretty good. Um, okay, so, for your benefit, Asher, uh, this is, or prof malicious, okay, can people say what their preferred names are so I'm not ping-ponging, because that's a major difficulty I often have. Um, but yeah, for context, basically... You are playing a bard in this, and you are questing to save the world from 
being destroyed by God and not in a malicious apocalyptic biblical apocalypse sense just in a God is bored and he wants to start fresh or she in this case hey there thanks for the show last night for a brief and shining moment this town had had life again Um, we've got this dude who, I swear, it just makes me think of the um, neighbour in um, Gumball. <laughs> Some days are really hard, but you never know when a really nice one is around the corner. Thanks for showing me that with your music. That show last night was so cool. You have a girlfriend? Mitzi! Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Ahoy! <laughs> yeah, that's all that one says. <laughs> uh, I feel I used to feel like everything was pointless. But after that show you put on, I'm a changed man. I'm going to make a difference in my life. I'm going to smile more. <laughs> my face is stuck. <laughs> oh, can't talk to her. teach me to get for getting up at about 10 to 4 in the morning as my body was wont to do <laughs> now that now that our audience is warmed up so to speak maybe it's time to break out my joke routine no don't don't please don't want to hear one What did the ox say to her kid when he moved out? Bye, son. But he doesn't have any new material since your performance. You already told me. You already told me that one. Oh. But it. But it was even funnier the second time around, wasn't it? Yeah. I probably should quit on this idea while I'm ahead. Yes, yes, you should. I always thought one day it'd be me on that stage. Well, I still do think that. Seeing your performance inspired me to work ten times harder. And just as a by the by, the voices I'm giving these characters this time around are completely different to the last time around. It's like this is a whole town of that one storekeeper in the Bizarre Bazaar. I went to your show alone, but while I was there, I made eye contact with this guy. Uh, last time I played it was last week. It kind of rocked my world. Backstory is important. But I want to take this just this one moment to let you know. Your show is great. Someday I'll tell tales of it as backstory to some other story. Yeah, that's exposition dump guy. And this this character kind of look reminds me of that one girl in Bob's Burgers. Uh, please don't talk to me about that Raven show. 
I keep hearing it was so awesome and blah 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 but I missed it because I was working this crud hole Okay, so nothing left to do here. <laughs> Your performance lit a fire in my teen heart. I felt so alive, I spray painted some property. I'm finally a proper teen, thank you. I'm actually glad you got me to play with you. I haven't had so much fun in a long time. And I like to thank my mum was watching too. Ace, that was great! I can't say it enough times! So that's the one character I can remember the voice I gave. Well, they, those two in fact. That was quite a show! Did you see? The audience loved me. You all did great too, of course. Oh, there you are. Oh wait, I gave her a witch's voice because she is a witch. I hear you've been busy putting on shows when I specifically said not to. Or did you forget that the world is ending? I learned the Overseer song, though. No. Oh, you did? Yeah. What do I do now? You go find the breathing crystals and sing that song. They're inside the cave we came through yesterday. Just follow the crystals all the way down. You aren't coming? No. What do you need me for? Apparently you got it all figured out yourself. I'm fine here. Come back after you're done. Well, okay. Well, apparently instead of going for witch voice, I went for Monty Python drag woman voice. my son. We don't have to sit. What voice did I give her? I've completely forgotten already. I went through so many. It's... We don't have to sing it so loud. I don't even know, know what I'd do if he heard it. Yes, unfortunately, I don't have any, um,
And we are suddenly covered in green. Everything is green, except for those. Well, that's kind of blue, but the rest is green. Though technically, depending on the language, that blue is also green. Language is weird. Okay, so... Alright, I need... Oh. There we go. I mean... Sure, I mean, it's a very expensive way you know what with the whole world ending thing and that sort of thing uh, okay This is not just your average platformer. This is a, oh God, what am I even doing platformer? And I'm, I'm gonna edit the volume a bit if I can. Okay. It does require a lot of quick reacting. Okay, so... I don't 
don't even know what... Unless that's what I'm meant to do. I don't... I don't... This is an evil design. Oh, come on. I had that. I had that. I was right on that. Smeg head. tasks me it tasks me and i wish i could remember the full quote the problem is you bounce around so much it's very difficult to There we go. Boing, boing, boing. And now. Now I'm just reminded of getting over it. <laughs> Is it Ben Fogey or something like that? Which I do have, so if anyone wants... If anyone wants me to play that I will even if I do have a particular focus for this channel um, not familiar with Jump King Yeah, you'll have to do that. This... I, I wouldn't... Because the thing is, most of this game I quite enjoy. <laughs> but there's certain sequences that just make me want to... Scream obscenities.
Just spread the word about. <laughs> yes, yes, very funny. I got there eventually. God, that was annoying. And what is... Of a sudden I've ended up wandering into the final level of Undertale. Oh, I see what I meant to do. And I help you. I'm looking for the Queen of Winds. Oh, uh, yes, that's what I'm. <clears throat> yes, that's what I am now. Just a little secretary. Uh, I'm so sick of her. Oh, I mean, trust me, you don't want to. She's useless right now. I don't do a single thing herself. Needs me around all the time. Won't let me leave this stupid castle anymore. And it's really important. No! Go home! Okay. I don't, I'm not sure. It's probably the closest. <sighs> I think it's just a puzzle. Which. I can't deal with this. I'm out of here. Burp. Why has my squire left me? I need your help. The world is ending, and I'm trying to learn the Earth Song. Please teach it to me. Well, first you're gonna have to shamal, motherfucker. Is that what you think I could... Oh, is that what I... Tripping over my words here. Is that what you think I should do? Huh? The song is important. 
It's the voice of this entire world. So should I really just teach it to you? Because you asked? Uh, are you asking me? Uh, I don't know, I don't know. I'm just not sure what's the right thing to do. I'm not supposed to give the Earth Song to just anyone. But if you really think I should, then... Oh, Christ. Yeah, uh, that's... <laughs> I need to sort out lighting here. Uh, um, well, I definitely think you should. If I learn the, uh, the song, I can save the world. And that's, like, definitely a good thing. So, what do you say? Very convincing. <laughs> you totally did it. I can't believe I actually learned a piece of the song. It seemed like I was never going to. Thank you. Yes, well, hmm, I just, I really hope I did the right thing. Oh my gosh, you did. I'm going to send you back out of the castle so you can go home. But if you happen to see my little squire, please tell him to come home, okay? Uh, and why do you... I, for... I forgot that's something I need to look up. Oh. It's the whole issue with the resolution because it keeps changing. Uh, hey! What? Queen of Winds said she wanted you to come home. So? So you're not going to? Are you kidding me? That Queen's got issues. I'm a frickin' bird. Gotta spread my wings and fly. It seems like she really needs you. I get it. And isn't it your job? My job is to squire for the Queen of Winds. Embodiment of wind, direction, freedom, that stuff. Whatever she is now, it's not that anymore. I mean, it's my only home, but, well, what would you do? Really? Yes. Ugh. Why do I keep letting her do this to me? Fine, I'll go back. Her Majesty's faithful helper to the end of eternity. Rumble, rumble. Whee! At least this game does show mercy in that you don't have to go through the same platforming again and again and again. Alright, I need to exit here. And talk to Morag. I mean, Miriam. You man! Oh, it's just you. You say that, but 
I've experienced some games where you have to go through the exact same path that you started with. It's frustrating. Oh, if it isn't... Oh, which shall I go for? My cute cave friend, my old bud, Mr. Monster. <laughs> There's no option to call him sir. Yes, I have. Um, basically, there's a bit of a kerfuffle between him and a human wizard that uh, he had to help um, sort out. Go with that. Mm. Your voice, it's changed somehow. And you, come and try singing to my boyfriend. I know it sounds silly, but I have a feeling. Going all stars in your eyes here. <laughs> Apparently today's show is brought to you by the colour green. Thank you. Then you began singing in strange symbols. I was worried. But you healed me. No human has ever treated us with such respect before. I almost want to say, maybe humans aren't so bad after all. Apparently this is a coupling between Arnold Schwarzenegger and John Major. I'm not saying that, though. Humans are still mostly terrible. You're okay, though. Good luck on your journey. Okay, human.
Delirium! Sheesh, welcome back finally! Overseer helped you this time? Good! We've got plans to discuss. You've had a little, nice little adventure, yeah? Yeah, I have. Well, the fun part is over now. The next nexus point is in the middle of the ocean. Navigating out there is stupid. So I'm chucking a ride with this captain. Who? I... <laughs> Just the cheesy grin he's got there. Before that, I could fly you back home. Or you could stay here in Delphi. I don't care. It's up to you. So you don't care about the fact that if I don't do this, the world is going to end. So what's it going to be? I'm not playing this game. Huh? I want to save the world. So I'm going with you. Huh? I did this attitude. You're really get ready to get serious about this? Yes. I'll be at the ship just outside of town. Don't keep us waiting. Hey now, Wanderer. I love candy. I came because of the sick tune they, pl they have playing. You wrote it, didn't you? I have something to show you. I know you know all about music, but how much do you know about dance? I want to teach you some moves. Wait, no. I want to unlock the moves that are already waiting inside you. Uh, I... Okay. Because you've got a dancing spirit, Wanderer. I'll just help you find it. Uh, okay. Beautiful dance, Wanderer. But this is only the beginning of your journey into dance. I hope we'll meet again in a place where dance calls out to us. You want me to explain how to dance? Oh, randomly, that's the one that they don't capitalize. Do you want me to explain how to dance? All right, I want you to close your eyes and picture something called a keyboard. Oh, Jesus Christ. It... If this is what I think it's going to be, I'm going to scream. You see it? On that keyboard, you've got to hold something called the Alt key to dance. But they seem a bit randomized with when they capitalize dance and when they don't. Weird. Then while you're dan while you're dancing, use E, R, X or C to change your dance. You can sing at the same time too. And some dances you can do even while moving around. Uh, uh, as opposed to the dances you can't do you can do whilst not moving around. Don't be afraid to express yourself, Wanderer.
Okay, so no change in the dialogue there. And what is with that fracking? Let's... Let's see if it behaves with that. It could well mean that. <laughs> Is this the way? Yes. Miriam! Well, ready to go? Ready. Well, so long, kiddo. This doesn't mean the end of the band, though, does it? Oh, man, <laughs> I feel rather, rather bad after that. <laughs> Act 3. Voyage of the Lady Ara... Arabica. Okay, that's the name you want to go with. Wow, a real pirate ship. Is this going to be go for the entire trip? Okay, doke. Well, maybe I'll still be around when you get back. Catch you soon. It might. Pirates are really cool, Miriam. Welcome, welcome aboard the Lady Arabica, matey. Yeah, this is so cool. Where are we going? Tatango Island Town. Are there more pirates there? Hey, you really like pirates, eh? They're pretty neat. Want to be a helpful part of our crew? How? Fetch me a coffee. Oh. <laughs> okay. Whee! <laughs> well, if it isn't the bard of 500 beans, I hope you realise you're never go getting those beans. That's okay. I didn't really want them. I also still have no money. Right. I'm the navigator for this ship, meaning I keep us pointed in the right direction. And that goes beyond the literal. I don't tolerate silliness. Eh, me neither. I'm on a serious adventure. I get a cup of coffee for the captain. Oh yes you can! There you go. That coffee just materialized.
I Okay Um And the coffee stays perfectly in the mug despite all the jumping I do Physics defying magical coffee cup Brought you the coffee So you did It's so good! I feel a song coming on. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. So apparently everyone stubbed their toe. Oh no. So apparently I ended up on the crew of Ziltoid the Omniscient. Oh, what a grumpy... You could have... You could have just burst in and gone, You are all weirdos! And be done with it, but no, you have to spoil the song. Jerk. like a cup of coffee after a long day. Too bad my part of the song was interrupted. I had a real showstopper already, let me tell ya. Whatever I'm mo whatever, I'm over it. I've got my coffee now. Ah, great singing out there today, matey. Something about you really lights up the music in my heart. Uh, eat. Let me know when you want some coffee. Hello, Groutman. How's it going? Warms my heart to see everyone with a nice cup of coffee. <laughs> also young and full of caffeine. Yeah, coffee! <laughs> hey, where'd your witch friend go anyways? God, they're giving the small they're getting the small child hopped up on caffeine. That's not a good sign. Yeah, enjoying myself. It's had a bit of a um moment of oh god, what am I meant to do here, but Overall, it's going well. Yeah, yeah, great job with the singing today. 
As if those pirates weren't obnoxious enough already. You should try having fun sometimes, Miriam. Yeah, I'll show you fun sometime. Um. Well, ready for some coffee? Yeah. That's the spirit. And once again, the coffee randomly materializes from nowhere. Ah, I love me some caffeine. Really gets me buzzing. So tell me, matey. You ever see a mermaid? Uh, not this one again. Ah, shut it, you scallywags. Have you? Ah, I was just a lad, a no name on some crew, and we found ourselves in the worst storm you ever heard of. We didn't stand a chance. The ship went down. I was drowning. I saw my whole life flash before my eyes. It was very boring. <laughs> I'm not sure if it was, but maybe that's what they're in search of. And that's when I heard her. As my vision faded, a beautiful voice singing from the deep. When I came to, I was safe on some shore. She saved me. Her music is the music of my heart. My mermaid savior. Of course, after that, they all vanished for years and years. Say, Beatty, you aren't drinking your coffee. He certainly has, although they're just searching the world. He was searching the whole universe, so he's got a leg up. Well, a few legs up on them. You aren't drinking your coffee. Oh, ha, yeah. I was totally distracted and also a little nervous. I've never had this stuff before. Never had coffee? 80, you've never lived! Give it a drink already! Um, okay. This, however, is not coffee, it's Ribena. Uh oh. Um... <laughs> so that happened! <laughs> So finally awake, eh? What happened? What happened was you caused a real ruckus is what happened. And you ain't never having any coffee ever again. I think it's less that it's from one cu cup and more because you've got an already excitable bard being given one very strong cup of coffee when he's never drunk it before. Also, I'm noticing a bit of peeking going on, so I'm just going to lower that ever so slightly. Go. Miriam! Well, hello there, sunshine! Feeling calm down now? Yes. Well, thank you. 
Is the nexus point here? No. We still have to find the... Yes. Overseer song. The time... This time I really have no idea who would know it. The nexus point is just on some uninhabited island. Because it's always an uninhabited island. This island's got people on it, though. So I guess... Just go ahead and do your people thing. Talking. Yeah, that. <laughs> oh, Miriam. Kind of remind me of an ex. Not in a good way. I regret... What is it with games and not allowing me to jump off the edge of things? First Final Fantasy XIV, now this. It's like they're insistent on me not being able to just yeet myself off a cliff. you doing here? You know the overseer about the overseer song. Overseer? Well then I'll have meal for the day. <laughs> I need time to ask. I hate to tell you this but the world is ending. Yes I know that. That's why I'm packing up my stuff. I'm gonna go chill on the beach till it all d goes down. Are you sure you don't want to go to the Winchester, have a pint, and wait for it to all blow over? I know about that already. Huh? About the beach? No, about the world ending. That's why I'm hit trying to stop it. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. For sure. I can divinate you just about anything. What are you looking for? Overseer song? Yeah. Hmm. Mm. Got it! Apparently the mermaids know it. Which is too bad. Since they vanished years ago and all. Did they leave the planet and say and sing a song saying goodbye and thanks for all the fish? Yeah, this is a more immediate world ending. Like, this can actually be prevented. Even I couldn't tell you where they went. Oh. So you can't really divinate anything, huh? Huh? Hey, I'm the best in the biz, okay? But it's not that simple. A divination like that would require hard to find stuff. Like what? You're serious, huh? To actually locate the mermaids. I'd need no less than the mermaid's tear. Huh? I have to make them cry? No, 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 no. It's a jewel, you dummy. Something they left behind. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to have to change voices because this is killing me already. You could go looking for it in the ruins, I guess. But be but warned, it's a heroic side quest thing. Oh, what? Uh, the tear is destined to be found by a hero, not a weird song dork. <laughs> but if you can get the jewel, then I can find the mermaids. Okay, I will find it. And then you will see who the hero is. Okay, so we're going with that name. Trying to think what uh, Calliope's deal was, or Calliope. Yeah, it would be Calliope.
Okay. Hi there. I'm a hero in training, as you can probably tell. Oh, God. I've just, it's just registered the hair he's got. My parents said heroics had no future, but I have to follow my dreams. So let me know if you hear about any, like, quests. Hmm. Heroic quests, huh? I definitely don't know about any of those. Okay. That wasn't suspicious at all. Thanks anyway. Don't tell anyone up that I actually ran away from home. I always wanted to travel the seas. But no one took me seriously because I'm a kid. So I took matters into my own hands. <laughs> that is basically what I'm going for. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't initially intended, but it just evolved like that. That's a pretty fantastic freakout you had last night from one coffee. You wouldn't last a second on our crew. <laughs> well, I kind of am on your crew, right? I guess. I got put on duty to sell the coffee beans. Usually it's Penny's job. Ugh, I'm so bored. Hey, uh, welcome to Anne's bomb shop. You want bombs? Because that's pretty much what I got. Why would I want bombs? You know, to blow stuff up. It's fun. I'll pass. Hi there, cutie. You look so helpless and adorable. Are you lost? No, I totally am not. If you say so. You! Oi! How do you do there, whippersnapper? We're not used to seeing your type in our little spot here. But don't you worry, we're friendly. Why not join us for a coffee? What do you think you're doing here, Pipsqueak? Uh, huh? Oh, look, Marcus. Weirdo's with us. Be cool. So step off, you jerk. Sorry about that. My wife recently left me. Made me feel emasculate. Whoa! Okay. So I felt the need to assert my physical dominance. Okay, so we're establishing some toxic mis misculanity? <laughs> Masculinity, even? <laughs> Laying out my masculine insecurities. See, uh, I'm glad you understand. I'll remove myself from the situation now. <laughs> uh, check. Um. Uh, okay, so that happened. Hey, thanks for sticking up for me. No prob. No prob. So I talked to the to a fortune teller, and she said I have to find the mermaids for the mermaids for my quest. Mermaids, eh? Yeah, and some tear jewel. We have to go to the ruins to find it. <laughs> I, I, I think you just said Voldemort in a crowded room. Ever since the mermaids disappeared, a huge monster took over their old temple. That's why it's... That's why it's the ruins, matey. Oh, but it's the only way to find the mermaids. I can't even tell you how much we've missed all, we've all missed the mermaids since they disappeared. Our voices gave such life and magic to the sea. We are a war 
Where? <clears throat> We're all worried they might have taken off. Or worse, if you could r really bring them back, you'd surely be a he hero to us all. Mm, yes, the mermaids. It would be kind of cool finding out what happened to them. All right, matey. We'll help you. Come, Nina, to the ship. Oh, how exciting. Bring the mermaids back soon, Ripper Snapper. <laughs> Allah, everyone's buzzing about a fancy new hero. Who's going to bring back the mermaids? That's you, isn't it? True! Aroma, are you the one who's going to save the mermaids? Um, yes. Oh! So you're out in the... You're out in the world. And you see a big suspicious looking crack in a wall. You'll wish you had bombs then. Crack's always been treasure. That's a weird reason to carry bombs around all the time. Oh God! What's happening? Everyone's gone nuts! Did you do this? Captain Lucas says you're searching for mermaids! What? Didn't they disappear years ago? I was fine just selling beans! He said you were bored. Captain says we're hunting mermaids now. Really got him all up in a frenzy. Almost as bad as the week he sw we switched to espresso. Oh boy. But I guess it's not a bad time to adventure. Bean sales go. <coughs> Bean sales are going swell. It'll be like a vacation. Okay. Captain Lucas said we're good to go. Want to set sail? Yeah. Hey, I'm done with this heat too. All right, matey. You know the way, so... Guide us with your music. Don't forget to hold it on any button to see the map too. No doubt I'll have to go back to there anyway, so... Yeah, I... I, I quite... Yar. Like, that's one of the things that... For the various times that I do have complaints about uh, the design... There's just something about this game that is just supremely charming and I can't... Um, I, I can't fault it for at least trying something different. This make, place makes my beard hard. <laughs> Let's try that again. This place makes my beard higher stand up. Be careful, matey. If you see the monster, run, hey? Eh? <laughs> OK. 
Okay. Oh! Okay. <laughs> So apparently he can't use his hands. Let's see how well that does me. Okay, I see what I've got to do. I see what you did there, Groutman. Smeg. Okay.
That was an awkward one. Really didn't need to do Right Oh, okay, so I can't just walk across that's weird Okay, so... idea if I'm going in the right direction because I've never played this before so I could be well apparently I was What the 
why does this... Why is it suddenly... <laughs> so that happened. <laughs> hey, 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 now I'm Wanderer. Sweet moves. Did you want to go back up? You know what? Sure. Cool. Whee! I've been wandering the ocean. Feels beautiful to get lost. I like not knowing where I am. There's one island in particular. Well, maybe I won't say too much about it. Some things are best discovered to yourself. Anyway, did you want to go back up? Nah. Cool. I wonder if there's a limit to how many times you can do that. You're alive? Are you alive? <laughs> You'd be a terrible ghost, matey. I found the tear. Really? I think. So you escaped the clutches of the monster. I didn't even see it. Ah. Huh. Thing I got doesn't look like a tear either. And I just got an achievement. <laughs> Which is probably one of those playing the game type achievements. Hey. Hmm. And you may have just the piece. Classic case of multi-step heroic quests. I have no idea where the rest would be. It's out there somewhere. I... Did you want to get back to the ship? I love how... Each time you sing during that. Yeah, pretty much. Get one to get back to the ship. The mermaids have magic vocal cords and made magical inventions to use them. Such beautiful creatures they are.
I could do with some indication of what you expect of me. Sorry for the cacophonic mix. Just, uh... Jingle is definitely reminding me of something I can't place. It kind of. I might not meant I'm not meant to be here just yet unless it's see sometimes people will complain about linear progression but sometimes Linear progression can actually be very good when you have no clue what you're meant to do. Uh, unless it's going with the exact same pattern there. So red flower. What the that was peculiar. yellow bird I mean he's yellow and black but there is no black on the wheel so so if I'm understanding this correctly blue yellow red
I just that was purely by <laughs> like sometimes the, this game can be a bit mean other times it can be very fairly clear you just need to be observant So that's a bit of a programming design bug that's studio. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's just staring at the sea. I got the other part of the tear. I don't say, well done, matey. Does this mean we can go to the mermaids now? I think I just got to show the fortune teller. And there is no time to waste. Did you get, did you want to get back to the ship? You're killing me, matey. Did you want to get back to the ship? So, just saying hi. Ah, okay. Hello. Why you're here? And listen, and I, uh, and listen, I get it. Hero stuff isn't for everyone. You did your best. Wait, 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 wait. I totally got the mermaid's tear. You, uh, really? Is that even possible? That's definitely it. Yeah. Oh, you can find the mermaids with this? <laughs> yes, I can! Here we go. Hmm. Can you lend me a hand? Like, try singing, maybe? An interesting way of doing it. Yes, I've solved it. I'm 
totally marking it on your map or whatever. And as payment, I'm keeping this jewel. This thing is worth a fortune. I'm going to have myself a nice pre-apocalypse vacation now. <laughs> sure, whatever. So, does this mean I'm a hero now? Uh, um, I guess it might. I'm going to do another divination on you this time. Let's see if you're really a hero, the hero foretold. <laughs> Holy cow. There's... No prophecy about you whatsoever. None. None whatsoever. What does that mean? I don't even know. Usually you at least see something. You know, for sure not the hero foretold. The hero foretold. I guess you're not not a hero. Mr. D just has no expectations of you at all. Well, good luck with that. World's still ending. I want to get out of here and to the beach. So it's time to scram, okay? I mean, that's wildly concerning. At the same time, it's harder to foil the plans of someone who's not predicted. Huh? What's that look at? What's that look on your face? Nothing. Well, I guess now we can find those mermaids, huh? What a set sail! Uh, hello? Where did everyone go? Quite possibly. It's you. Did you tie up, my friends? Yes, and I'm very sorry about that. But you see, I believe the reason my wife left me was my finances. What I'm saying is I'm poor. But I understand you now have a very valuable jewel. So you see, I had no choice but to sneak onto your ship, tie up your friends, and demand it as ransom. Oh, oh Jack! I agree! I suppose I has no idea what he's in for! I'm gonna blast- Well, wait, wait. Even if this guy's a jerk, we don't have to blast him. I'd honestly be okay with it at this point. Seriously, what a jerk. Ah, I can see where this is going. Little Billy wants to save the day without hurting anyone. But that doesn't work in this situation! Some dudes need to be blasted! I mean, she's not wrong. Just give me a chance. Give me that jewel. I totally don't even have it. I don't believe you. Dirty scallywag. After all that coffee, the crew had a rough caffeine crush. He caught her snapping. Still too tired for this. Mm. 
believe I let this fool get me get the drop on me. Listen, youngin. Gotta stash stuff stash of stuff in the mess hall for this kind of occasion. Go do this right now. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff back here. Yes, I'll take. <laughs> Always knew Marcus was dirty, but not like this. I think you know a guy. We were so close to finding the mermaids. You're gonna do something, do it soon, matey. From far away, I thought you were bringing the jewel. That's a cup of coffee. Are you offering it to me? You want to leave us alone now, huh? No. My emotions are now running higher than ever. You have only escalated this situation. Oh. Thank you, matey. Now we can finally set sail. For the mermaids. Are you ready, kid? Captain! I'm, so, I'm disappointed he didn't go, I can't hear you! Finally so close. You don't mind if I come with you, I You don't know what we'll find here. They could have been imprisoned by a great beast of the sea. Or worse. But that's really terrif what's really terrifying. The idea of seeing her again. It's making me heart tear itself apart. Sound effect. Err, sheesh. Where, where are you holding your breath? I'm losing it, her matey. You gotta understand. I've been thinking of this moment for years. It'll be okay. Even if it's not okay. It'll be okay. <laughs> Sound effect is Maybe I shouldn't do this. What? If they really are in danger. What if I can't help her, matey? Or be the fool, not a not the hero. You can be the hero. You can be the hero, baby! I believe in you. Oh, uh, humans. Are you in danger? Uh, no. Oh. Ha <clears throat> okay, I've got to do my valley girl impression here. Like, how did you get here? 
Well, I came to see you with the red hair. Years ago, you saved my life on in a shipwreck. But a day's gone by that I ain't thought of you. Your kindness. Kindness? <laughs> yeah, um... I, I'm not sure what I was expecting, but, um... It's a choice. That looks like Bet. Yeah, it kind of looks like Bet Midler in Hocus Pocus. So, I decided I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Will you take my hand in marriage? Like, uh, whoa. You remember this guy, Mel? Uh, hmm. Nope. After all these years, this is exactly why we hid ourselves in the first place. You mean you chose to run away? Yeah! Oh my gosh, you humans. And your demands! We couldn't, like, live our lives. The thing I need is re- But the thing I need is really important. Trying to learn the Overseer song to save the world. Hmm. I guess that demand isn't so bad. But if we teach you all the song, you gotta promise to keep this spot secret here. We can't be dealing with humans all up in our faces anymore. Are you sure? Everyone misses you. And I kind of promised I'd bring you back. Yeah, we're sure! Well, I guess we can agree to that. Okay, sweet! Come down here in front of the waterfall. We can make the whole thing out of it. Dang, your voice is banging. Okay, let's do this. Devastated by that. Uh huh, that's the song. Now scram. Hey, your friend. He's gone. I probably hurt his feelings. I feel kind of bad. He is kind of cute. And I know it makes me like such a cliche. But I really dig his pirate aesthetic. I guess he can come back whenever he wants, but just to hang out. Gets kind of lonely here. One human to chill with sounds okay. And we're walking, and we're walking. Jeez, is the captain upset? Guess the mermaid thing didn't pan out, huh? 
Falling in love seems pretty dumb. Well, you got the song at least, right? Ready to head to the Lost Waterfall? Miriam! Yep, Queen Chaos's nexus point is ahead. You know what to do. You, you sure you don't want to come with? It could be fun. Ass! Apparently, all I do is get in the way! I'm fine here! What? It's not like that. Uh, I don't need you to tell me what it's like. I don't even care. I'm just gonna chill here, okay? Go be the hero or whatever. Well, okay. Young I heard you was leaving. Be careful out there, you hear? It like you could run into trouble real easy. But you can always come back to us. Up that way. When you first showed up on our boat, I was sure you were going to be a huge nuisance. And I was right. But I'll miss you anyway. Good luck on whatever strange, silly thing we're doing next. <clears throat> kind of ended up giving him a bit of a Doug Bradley voice there. You really left an impression on this crew. I think even grumpy old Francis warmed up to you. Please stop calling me Francis and old. See, he doesn't even like me yet. I'm very charming. <laughs> oh. Hey, itching us, huh? Well, I have to go save the world. And you're so cool. Well, matey, we had a good run, eh? Even if we're both losers. At least we were losers together. Oh yeah. Actually, the mermaid said you could come back when evs. When evs, you say? What does that mean? I think it means any time. Guess my salty charm worked on her sweetheart after all. Thank you, matey. You made me wildest dreams come true. Even if you couldn't bring the mermaids back, you're a hero to me. <laughs> okay, if someone could clip that, that'd be great. <laughs>
Yeah. Uh, that was rather cute, I'm not gonna lie. Nothing good comes of a realm made of crystals. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Should have kept jumping there. Yeah, go for it. Thanks for that. Hello. You may think I'm just a... It's the Babel fish. I am in fact also a key. If you see me floating about, Please bring me along to locked doors. You'll find I'm much more handy than the average fish. Oh, should I be giving him a Yogi Bear voice then? I mean... There's a particular series that um, at the end of the year they'll go over the... what they term the rectal spective and all the various things that in hospitals people manage to get in their assorted holes and some very peculiar things have ended up in people's ears candles for example and um oh what oh yeah christmas ornaments Ooh. Okay, so... Uh, this is very... This is a mean one. And I, uh, if I can ask... Are you here to meet Queen Chaos? Is that the overseer? 
Yes. She has a really cool name. I'm her little helper, so to speak. But she's been acting very odd of late. Every overseer has, I've met has been acting weird. Hmm. There we go. Oh, Smeg. Just insects ending up d anywhere in your person? Just no. Have you ever wondered what the overseers are? Why the overseers are acting strangely? Aren't they supposed to? Oh, something is very wrong. It's a sign of the end times. Oh, that sounds bad.
kind of reminds me of the bit at the start of Fantasia where it's discussing the different uh, chords. Quite good for time. Oh, holy moly. This game does not play around at times. Oh, flip. This is nerve-wracking, I'm not going to lie.
At least it's got very good checkpointing going on. I, I, I guess. I mean, they're in the realm of chaos, so it's a primordial ooze. Embody the natural forces that sustain our world. But as the universe grows old, they grow unhappy, lose their way. Their corruption slowly spreads. And so the world begins disintegrating as well. Hmm, sounds pretty bad. So, they're sort of... Fragments of the world as it's decaying, I guess. As best understanding I can... Uh, This is an awkward one. That's the cat running off. Tell me. Are you here to complete the ritual? I don't know what that is. I'm going to learn the Earth Song. Oh! I see. Well, never mind. Go ahead and enter.
Oh god, this is reminding me of one of my D&D games. Uh, one of the players ended up getting stuck waiting for um, me to get back round to them. So, and where they'd been left off was constantly climbing these never-ending stairs. I mean, it was good for his cardio. Right. Okay. I thought of it at the time I might have um, this was years and years ago did, did you just kill the overseer who are you the name is Audrey Redheart and I'm the hero the hero that's right the hero chosen by Ia on a quest to defeat the 70 Overseers and rid the world of evil. Wait, I don't think you understand. I'm on a quest to meet the Overseers to learn the Earth Song. He have already picked me. No, you definitely don't understand, little bard. What? What is going on? Um... Well, basically, the Earth Song isn't going to work. It won't? No. In every cycle of the universe, every single time, it's never worked. The world is too filled with discord, especially when it gets this old. And that's where I come in. To destroy each overseer and free the world of their corruption. And that is going to save the world. No. The Overseers hold your whole world together. But when they get old and messed up like this, there's no way to fix them. The moment the last one dies, that's how the world ends. So the next cycle can start. Right. Sorry. I know it sounds sad, but that's the way it's supposed to be. I didn't really think you'd make it this far. So I was supposed to give up? Just let the world end? Why did you even tell me about the Earth Song in the first place? Because I really like you, and I didn't want to tell you no. I still don't. But I have to be realistic. I'm an angel of Ea and a guide to the hero. My job is to usher in the end and pave the way for a new beginning. Sheesh, quick being such a baby. This is just the way it works. You really thought you could sing some song and solve everything? How about you leave it to the real heroes? How about you 
Leave the shutting up to you. Oh no, wait, don't. Like something went wrong, so I came. Um, are you okay? No, I'm not the hero, Miriam. I'm not cool or strong or anything. And I thought I could save the world, but I can't. So I'm just gonna lie here forever. And everyone will forget about me, and then the world's gonna end. That's dumb. You're being really dumb. Nobody ever thought you were a hero anyway. That doesn't make me feel better at all. I mean, that's not what's good about you. You're good because you're always all happy and singy. I wish I was like that. I'm grumpy and useless. You make everything better by being happy at it. Well, I'm not happy now. Even if we wanted to learn the Earth Song, we can't now that an overseer is dead. Actually, no. You can talk to ghosts, right? Huh? There's still something here. Something's here. Yeah, I don't know. All around here is some kind of spirit. Come on, do your body thing and sing. get it Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing. This game has a tendency to hit you like a ton of bricks. At least from what I saw when... Because this is all as a consequence of watching a stream myself of it. Okay. I don't like this.
Okay, this explains why there's so many achievements. Unless this is literally just a joke thing. <laughs> Yeah, those are just joke achievements. Hey, Audrey. Don't forget. You can point your sword straight up to charge it with lightning. Ugh, shut up. Would have figured that out myself. Oh, okay. God, what a bitch. Unfortunately, I think this is all to just emphasize a character that you wouldn't... You wouldn't actually want to be playing as. Is it? That's right, I'm gonna have to have Sporks Bingo for um, being on the wrong screen. Another human. You were to be all loud. You here to be all loud and annoying like the last one. That sure was a riot. That lot of good they did. Queen of Winds is doing just awful. If you were wondering, acting all dark and spooky. She keeps birthing monsters. Oh, it's so gross. It's getting worse every day. Ah, shut up! I'm here to take care of the Queen of Winds. Tell me where she's hiding. Take care of... Oh, jeez. Well, I... am obligated to stop you. Shut up! Okay. I'll see where this is going. And I don't want to be here for it. 
just trying not to make it painful for her, you know. Really so sweet. Or she used to be. Well, that's mildly concerning. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. down. Yeah, girl. You the bomb. I know, right? Can I ask you something? Yeah, girl? I just don't get why you never told me we were going to end the world until that bard was around. It's complex. Not that it's bothering me, huh? Oh god, it's Edge Lady McGee. Complicated. Sorry you found out found that out in such a lame way. I'm not really supposed to tell the hero that until like the very end. Because it's hard for normies to understand why it's unimportant. Normies? You know, like mortals. Your planet being doomed is kind of sad. But we're clearing a, a path for a new, better universe. Hey, I completely get it. Nothing normy about me. Someone has to stop the spread of the Overseer's corruption. And kill them before they be all become horrible monsters. May as well be me, right? That's why you're the hero. Yeah, girl. <laughs> yeah, girl. You're a team, right? So anything you tell that bard, you can tell me too. Noted. Right? Well, I'm out. I'll hit you up later, okay? Four. 
Arch of the Happy Factory. Okay, well... It's coming up to six. And I think... Oh. Okay. I'll wait until... Hey, Lil B. Well, if I call you that, Lil B. Still mad, huh? You lied to me. You said I could save the world. You never really believed in me. And the Earth Song doesn't even work. It could work. It just never has. Burning it is more than going around collecting stuff. It's like all spiritual. All world in harmony type stuff. And that part is really hard. It gets depressing. Watching people try and fail to save their world. I've seen it play out so many times. Why do you even care? Because I like you. Even though I didn't think you'd make it, you proved me wrong. You're special, Lil B. I'm done not believing you in you. Even if Audrey's the hero. I don't want to think I want to see her again. Yeah, she can be a little intense. She's actually really cool. No, she's not. Don't... Don't for one second try to convince us she is. Because she's not. You two hung out more. You totally love her. No, no. I, as a player, wouldn't, and I'm, I would hope that he wouldn't either. Trust me. Okay, I'm going to get back to her now. It does come across like that. <laughs> Why don't you get out of bed at least? Don't give up, little bee. <laughs> okay. As we're just getting into the new chapter and all that, that's where I'm going to leave it for today. And yeah, we've made decent progress. Next time I next time I stream is will be same time next week, so three till six on Wednesday. I'm I'm finding this a comfortable slot. One thing I am going to have to remember is being certain to notify more places like my Twitter and Facebook and all that sort of thing because I've been a bit uh, slow on remembering to do that. But with that out of mind, uh, that's it for today. Um, if if pe well. At the moment, I think it's just you, Groutman, but if you're interested, I've got a new review that'll be sorted out. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I didn't deliberately do the Monty Python voices, that it just slipped into them. Um, just a quirk of voices that I found comfortable. But uh, yeah. Um, I'll ha hopefully have a new review coming out either tomorrow or Friday, so that's going to be a review of a single that was thrown m in my direction by the artist. So, it, and that's going to be a fun one because it's a silly song. So there'll be that to look forward to in the next couple of days. Anyway, catch you later. And yeah, let's, even if there's just one person, um, let's sort out uh, doing a raid. Oh. Uh, let's see who is there to raid. Uh, might as well go over to Robot. 
Right. And so that's it for today, Cat. Catch everyone later.